owners, designers, um, and mother and daughter team of Motto Fashions wear on social networks at one o'clock weekdays to play with fashion, to show you how to put it together, and lots of other things. And today, we're doing brightly coloured suits. So, we're going to show you all the different ways you can wear these bold, poppy colours because it's not just about doing the head to toe. There's so many different ways. Oh, yeah, this is a great look. This is my favourite way. Well, it's like, if you love it's it like so this, much more. So much more. And if you love it like this, it's a very fashion forward way to wear it. You would have seen it all over Instagram and, you know, magazines and things like that. But when maybe you've done it once, twice, three times and you go, okay, I want to wear that amazing suit again, but how can I make it look different? That's it. This is what, what I'm going to show you. What else can you do with it? And exactly. We've got lots of ideas. We've got lots of ideas. So if you love what you see, head over to our website, motto.com.au. And um, if you are watching after we're live, please don't forget to put hashtag replay in the comments so we know you're watching. So, you've got the cobalt. Now, we are we do have different styles on. So, maybe we can just quickly uh, let everyone know. Style, so you've got the same uh, pant, pant, pant. No, mine doesn't have a zip front. And so, yours mine does. has a zip front. And Lauren has a pull-on. So many people said, what about a pull-on? Well, there it is. So, mine nice. also has belt loops. Is yours? I can't remember. Mine has. But it's actually, it's actually the same, the same thing. But this one does have a zip with a button to secure up the top. So, it doesn't, it doesn't actually pop out at all. No, no, no. Show, no, show your out. side, you too. Do you want to show your side, you? See, you kind of get the same look, just, so, just in case people want to know. So I'm wearing um, a cami. Yes. Are you wearing the same cami? Yeah, yeah. But mine isn't an exact match, but I just wanted to put it on to show you the differences in the cobalts that we do have. If you see a few different pieces online, it looks okay. It does not have to be an exact match. See, I'd wear it like this, wouldn't you? Yeah, I, they looks, look the same. They actually look the same. It looks fantastic. It's no yeah. problem. Um, yeah, and still looks good. So it's just a shade, a, a difference. One a shade, shade shading, different. yeah, yeah. Just a little bit different shading. Yeah. I don't even know if you can see it with the lighting. No. And I have our well-renowned Cisco blazer. What is it out? We're famous for this blazer. Mm. Yeah, we've won awards for this blazer. Award-winning. That's what I was looking yeah, for. Yeah, the way it makes your body look is really quite astounding. Just trust us. Yeah. Hot. Just the cut gives you an hourglass shape. So I'm shushed. Have our armbands on. Um, available in gold and silver at the moment, not, not black, but uh, I should have probably put the silver ones on. The silver ones look just as good, just because I like to zhuzh, and because I'm an eight, excuse me, wearing a 10, it just gives me that little bit, uh, I don't know, more sophistication. Of course, adding a belt always makes it cool. I like to do a bit of a knot with my belt, and this colour is sensational. Mm -hmm. Wear it with platforms because they're quite long. We have actually added a couple of extra centimetres in this pant, so for all the really leggy, Luscious, long-legged ladies, this is the one. Yeah, right, absolutely. Because yeah, they are right. extra long. Yeah. Now, the fabric is a ponty, so it's super, super stretchy. And sometimes when you put ponty in a warm wash or you hang it, like, underneath a, a, a hot vent, it can shrink. So if you are tall, all you need to do is when they're wet, you pull them out of the wash, always wash in cold water, pull the legs lengthways, and it just restores the fibres, and then let them air to dry without the hot air on them. Okay, just mm -hmm. so, so we recommend that you never use a dryer for this fabric. No, don't use a dryer just ever in general for anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. Cool. All right, so, so mine, um, the, my blazer is a little bit different. I've got on the same cami as Faye's got on. And the thing I love about this cami is it's actually a little bit shorter. So when you want to tuck in, sorry, that's my cami underneath, that's not part of it. When you want to tuck it in, you don't get a huge amount of bulk. You know, sometimes there's just like too much bulk down here and you're like, oh my God, what do I do with that? Then I have on a longer line blazer. So Faye's was a shorter length. Mine is like thigh length. And I want to mention my entire outfit also comes in cobalt. But Faye's jacket and pant does not come in green. So if you want the longer length blazer or the pull-on pant, it also comes in cobalt, as does the cami. So my three-piece set is in cobalt and red, and it will be available in black in the coming weeks. It's got this little cute zip. So you can do it up. And I think actually I would do it up if I was going out. The zip's really pretty because it's there's gold. There's a little bit more sophistication when you just have, when you're wearing the jacket sort of as a top, isn't it? I agree. Because I totally yeah, it's agree. It's a different vibe altogether when you're doing that. It looks very trending and what I love even more, and the pants are a bit short for me, so it's hard for me to show you this, but I'm going to show you it with a sneaker because if I had longer legs or if I had the pants taken up or if I put them in the dryer, uh, there's an idea, then I think that that is a really cool wow. look. 
Isn't that so lovely? Long, super oh, they're not too long. Yes. Yeah. So when you're complaining, thinking, oh my goodness, those pants are a bit on the short side. Don't worry, because showing a full sneaker under there is super cool. It's really cool. And actually, because pants are so in at the yeah, moment, that, that even if you've got a bit of a shorter pant, yeah, this yeah. Is a, it's, a, it's a vibe. I mean, start looking around. Don't listen to us. Pant lengths can be too long, too short, at the ankle, below the ankle, showing your foot. Like, at the, this season, anything goes. So, yeah, so cool. I love it like that, Lauren. Yeah, Mind too. you, I love it long as well. So it's about your personality and your personal preference, I'm sure. Oh, I like that combo. So this yeah, is wow. a little bit, look, it's a little bit unusual. This peachy colour is probably a little bit warm for me. I'll show you what it looks like. Not the kind of thing I would normally wear, but just that hint of blue to me just seems to bounce off nicely and I get away with it, in my opinion. Mm. So I've done a bit of a cord tuck, so I like the prettiness. I yeah, like to sort of spread. If I'm just wearing a shirt, I like to spread it out which actually brings this up a little bit, but that's cute. This sort of stays there. If really I'm cute. Around like this, that would be fine. Obviously, I won't have these like that. I'd wear armbands, but I've purposely left them off because I'm about to put my blazer on just to show you what that looks like. And Alexandra, we actually do... Um, Alexandra on Facebook has just asked us what um, what's the hem like on your pants, and I'll show you. We actually do a deep hem on our Ponty pants. You can see how deep it is there. So if you do want to take it down, you can. So we always do that with Ponty, just because it can have that shrinkage factor, but if you want to bring it back to the original length, pull them. And if you do need to get them taken up, you have to wash them first, because you don't want to end up with them too short. Yes, you don't want to do that. So I'm I this. love the orange and the cobalt. Yeah, it's absolutely it's gorgeous. It's stunning, isn't it? It allows a little bit on the big side for me, because I think it's actually a size 12. Is it? What? Oh, oh, sorry, is it? got a funny feeling. But I remember thinking, oh, oh that's yeah. Right. yeah, that's okay. No, it's a 10. Oh, it's a 10. Okay. Yeah. So everything that... Oh, oh my God, I moved the thing. Sorry, guys. Did I do that? Was that me? You did, yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry. Yeah. There we are. You stuffed it all up, darling. Sorry. It's okay. All oh, good. It's all fixed now. Yeah. That's the thing when you're yeah, right, right? Everyone probably thought it was a bit of an earthquake. Going <laughs> <laughs> Sorry! Sorry! <laughs> oh wow, that's nice. Yeah, so, quite spectacular. And look, don't worry about the ruffle, because this one actually, out of all the ruffle shirts, sits quite flat. And you wanted to show something there. Just something that's a little bit cool. A bit of a cool factor. Yeah. Especially and those sleeves hanging there. I'll just put that And face there. shirt as well is a button through. So if you want to do like, you know, the quarter tuck, it actually completely unbuttons, so you can do a lot with it in terms of zhuzhing. What a tuck. Mm. Yeah, I love that. Nice. Love that. Very, very cool look. Fabulous colour combinations. They're brilliant. And this has got that little dobby. We call it a dobby when it's a spot that's woven into the fabric. Very pretty, I reckon. Very you pretty. know what? It just that, feminises the suit. Having that cuff, sorry, Insta, I'm just, can you hear me, Instagram? Because Faye's phone is like pushing on the, the sound button. Do you know what I mean? It Sorry, I'm too scared it's going to... Let us know if you can't hear us Insta. No, there we go. Yeah, they can hear. Oh. yeah, but it's on the sound. Oh, that, I'm yeah. going to have to move it up. I'm sorry, guys. I don't know if it's a problem, though. Well, it will be because it keeps on turning the sound off. See, the sound is off. Okay. Now that's better. Although now we're crooked. Oh, my goodness, we are... <laughs> All right. Okay. Sorry, guys. Okay, so then... Um, I think we're good now. Now we're crooked. But you know what? We still look good, right? Yeah. It's all Thumbs up. It's still all us. Um, okay, so I just wanted to show you as well a new top that has come in now. This is called our Venice top. And it comes in... Um, it, it's like a black and an ivory print. It's not a stark white, just so you know. But I feel like sometimes a stark white, it's not always good on the skin. I think when it's got a little bit of warmth to it, that's when it really, like, brings out the glow. And um, the beauty of this is you can do it a little bit of an off-shoulder. I'm wearing a size 10. This is it untucked. Still oh, really nice untucked, though, is, isn't it? It's a it's very, like, resort vibe. Yeah, that's a gorgeous top. And I'll show you the back because there is a decent amount of length. And then you saw me have it tucked in before, but I just think sometimes, like, with the blazer as well... Oh, yeah, what a stylish look. So if I was going to do the blazer, though, I would tuck it. Because see how it just looks a bit crumpy? See that? It doesn't look that yeah, good. Yeah, I think when you do that, it is kind of crumpy. You've got to tuck it in. All right, Lynn. Um, this is Lynn on Facebook. She's just saying, is it black or white, black and ivory? It is black and an ivory. But it's a bright ivory. I don't have a white to show it's you. It's not I mean, dull. Yeah, it's not dull. This is more of a white. That's actually not even a stark white. But then you can kind of see the difference there. 
it's really quite beautiful on and again sometimes that really stark contrast it just sometimes it can wear you this is not one of those it does have that softness to the print even though it's quite high contrast okay so that's cute you know that this is quite a big top well you don't know i'll pull it out then you'll know it's still quite nice just it's like just a hang around top look yeah it's i a like bit, that a bit stylish when you put it off one shoulder and it's kind of not too out there you know sometimes if you it's want something bit, that tones you down that's right it's just that little bit more classic but for me being shorty since i do this i'm a little bit of a shorty mm. i'm going to just i might just do a bit of a side tuck maybe mm. just to show off that belt a wee bit and you know that if it comes down too far you just grab the back and pull it down and then you've got just a nice drape happening so I rather like this warm with this fabulous cool blue. I think that's a nice mix. Opposite on the colour wheel, always works. Yeah, really. Yeah, I love the brown and the blue. Love that. Very classic European look, this, I think. Very classic. And, of course, you can do the full tuck if you want. Often with Ponty, though, you can see a lot of, you know, um, fabric when you tuck in. So what you do in this case, you grab it and you do... You fold it into a little bit of a tuck like this. Just see what I did then? Kind of fold it into a bit of a tuck. Go down to there. So you don't get much to tuck in. And then you simply just do a little bit on the top. And it actually stays quite secure. And you don't get those extra bulges that you would on something like that. Mm, yeah, nice. Jackie nice. on Facebook's just asking, my black and ivory top, was it a size 10? Yes, it was a size 10 and it's generous. So if you are in between sizes, don't be afraid to go the smaller size. I think like the sizes probably, they're not that different. When something's oversized, it's kind of oversized regardless, but don't be afraid to um, size down if you wanted to. All right, so I just wanted to show you guys what a pink and a green looks like, because it's obviously really bold, but it doesn't have to be really strong. Now, if you're going to wear this, I wouldn't do the green underneath. It's just so, so ignore that, okay? So I've done a really soft, um, pretty pink. It's not too strong because I'm letting the green still be the hero. All right, um, Carly's asking, are we restocking jewellery anytime soon? Yes, we actually have a heap coming. Stay tuned, it'll all come out. Like, a lot of it will be next week. Um, but just sit tight, you'll notice it popping up. Each day is a little bit different. Um, yeah, Jackie's saying she might size down in that black and white top. Yeah, I think, I think you could. You could easily. So I'm loving the pink and the green. I think it looks really feminine and girly, whereas just head-to-toe green can look quite bold and strong. This is looking really girly, isn't it? It is. It's much prettier by just changing a lot. In fact, that was the point of today. By just changing a blouse, something so simple, mm. you get a totally different look. And it looks totally different, really. It does, doesn't it? Doesn't it? it? Yeah, I'm quite surprised. It does look different. Now, this sleeve also has the gathered um, elastic cuff, so really easy to do your zhuzhing, which I love. But, um, so you don't need to wear armbands as well, but the fabric's really, really beautiful and silky. So it just collapses in your sleeve, so you can easily do tight sleeves on top. Oh, that's the same shirt yeah, as me. That's what I thought. I, not that's what I thought. I knew that. I was going to say, this is the bold print compared to Lauren's very feminine look. I have a bit more of a bold, I don't know, uh, brighter, more summery look. What do we call yeah, this? Yeah, it's actually made the cobalt look very summery, I think. Yeah, it looks yeah, yeah, quite yeah. different. So get out, when the sunshine comes out, you can do this look. This is actually really smart. Nice combo together. Have a look. Love that combo. Actually, this belt seems to work with everything I It does. Like. It does. Uh, I feel like cool. when something's metallic, it kind yes, of goes you get away thing. with it. That's that's the thing. I think we still have some of these left. It's yeah, cool. we do. What's it called? The, the island belt. belt. Yeah. And it also comes in ivory. Perfect colour. It's sort of like a pinky brown metallic look. Rather nice. So, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. I like that. All right, now, guys, I'm moving on to something we call our Charlie shirt. Now, this print I've put together like this because it's quite unique, and I feel like this is one of those things that you'd never know how to put it together. If you're shopping online, obviously if you go into a motto store, then you can see how things look together. But it's like once you actually put it on, it so doesn't match, but that's why it matches. So the shirt is like a real khaki, a light khaki with your soft pink and then a little bit of ivory included. And everything about this suit doesn't match it. But I feel like this is where you're looking a bit quirky, very well put together. What do you think? Do you Ooh, like yeah, this? I love it because yeah. it's so unexpected. 
Who would have thought it would go? But that, exactly. That actually, that shirt. I actually didn't hate it with your blue suit too, because the no, I wore it. Deciding which way to go. That actually works with so many things. Yes. Yeah, it does. It even works with magenta. We've also got a suit in magenta, same as Faye's, and a deep forest. This shirt kind of works with all of them. Um, and just remember, if you're going to do a shirt cuff under your jacket, the coolest way to wear it is to undo your cuffs and then have your armbands. You don't want them to be tight because it just doesn't look as good. So have your cuff hanging out, then you do your armbands like there. And that's just a really easy way to wear it all day. All right, Joan's asking, what is the pink blouse called that I had on? It's called the Bailey blouse, B-A-I-L-E-Y. B-A-I-L-E-Y, Bailey. And it also comes in um, pale blue, which is also quite cute with this Very suit. Very pretty, actually. Yeah. Pale blue with the other colour that looks good. As well as this print, and I think that's it then, isn't it? Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. Okay, I love that. Okay, so I'm going I love to do something colors. that's a little bit different now. So you're cold, you're over your suit, you want to do something different because it's winter, and I'm leaving my cami on because that's going to give me warmth in any case. And then I'm going to add a really nice chunky jumper. Yeah, cute. I love that. Are you going to do your blazer over your shoulders? Maybe. Yeah, I'll throw it on. And well, um, the raincoat would have been perfect. But we don't have one now. Why? Yeah. Because... Yeah, we don't have one here. No, we don't. No. Okay. But the, 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 coat, raincoat, the raincoat would be hot. The raincoat would be amazing. In fact, any of the colours would look really fantastic. So I've just got my rain hat on. Um, a little bit matchy, but I didn't like it. With... Just, uh, not that I didn't like the red, I just think it's, gonna, it's not going to be right without the jacket. But in this case, if it's just the, the hat, mm -hmm. I probably would just throw on my coat. Yeah, cute. Hat. I love that. Now, I maybe I should try wearing it like with, with my arms in there to see if it works. Yeah, we will. This is what it looks like now. Mm. And even that was a sneaker, like what a cool oh, vibe. Yeah, I, I'm a bit too short to do that look, but yeah. I love it. Yeah, I'm going to one sneaker. See if it works. All right, and then I've also popped on a knit, and I'll show you guys. I want to do a sneaker, but because the pants are a bit long, I don't want to wreck them. But I want to do one sneaker, just so you guys can see. You know, this is, this is I almost, I'm going to go out on a limb and almost say, if you like that cool street look, a sneaker is even better with a suit than a heel. It's oh, just because we're short. Yeah. Like, how cool is this as a vibe? The shoes are huge on me. I look like I've got huge feet right now. So beautiful. Okay. Look, I'm wearing this like a big jacket, okay? I like it. Like it. And it works. Like it. And it does work. I'm a 10. I mean, I'm an 8 wearing a 10 jacket with definitely a big jumper. This is a small medium, which is equivalent to a 10. And the pants. And it actually does work. I think it looks pretty cool. But I wouldn't do it up. If I've got the jumper on, I'm leaving it open. And leave no, myself there. Yeah, I, I think that's kind of a bit of a cool look. And yeah, look, we can roll this up. I'm, I'm going to try it, but I just yeah. feel like it's all going to be a bit too chunky if I do that. Okay. I just like to show you the wrist. It does work. No, it doesn't. Believe it or not, it's not too exactly. chunky. And because I'm the blaze is so stretchy, it's so easy to do this stuff with. You know, if it was a really, if it was like a suiting fabric, I feel like it wouldn't be as easy and flexible. Yep, this works. Mm. I'm going to leave the belt on because I think it does work. You just can't do it up because it looks silly. Don't do it up. But in general, I feel like don't do your blazer up unless you're wearing your blazer as the top. But this is quite comfortable around the neck. It's not weird under the arms there. And it's a, because it just collapses. So this, to me, is a thumbs up. It works. Thumbs yeah, up. I love it. Yeah, love, love that. It. And then I've done the same concept as Faye. Layer up your jewellery up here. I've only got my own personal necklace on. But again, more is coming soon. Pink jumper, because a lot of them have sold out, the jumpers, you can't sit, up, sit on the fence with our knits, okay? Um, then I've got a size 10 blazer on top, really, really comfy. I feel like there's plenty of room, but you're going to pull up the sleeves because you want the definition of a wrist, and this way you're still warm. It doesn't have to be actual wrist, just what would be your wrist. Oh, and I've done a sneaker. Oh, sorry. Yeah. I'm just reading a comment. There's a girl saying, I am 10, would I be better with larger pants then to go with the same, same as Faye. Faye. Yes, sure. Why yep. not? Size up in the pant if you want it like Faye looks. Where yeah, do, do you like me? I've got these things tucked in, so it's sort of making a bit of a yeah. I feel though, I know I say I'm an eight, but I'm actually a good ten in the middle. So just bear that in mind. I'm not actually that small. So it's just the legs where I, I feel like I'm a little bit mm. slimmer than you know, I'm more of an eight in the legs. Yeah. But yes, go up, you won't be disappointed. If you're going to layer it like this, if you're just going to wear it with a cami, 
you need to zhuzh, because it actually did work. I just zhuzhed, pushed my yes. arms um, and my sleeves up with armbands and looked pretty good. And yeah. still wore it undone. Probably if I'm going to wear something like this done up, I bet you it, I would need to add a belt over the top. Yes, Which would be fine. Then you're wearing it, then you don't do the buttons up and just wrap it around you and wear your belt and you're fine. So I think you'll be fine going up, ladies. Yeah, Definitely. I agree, totally. It just depends on how you want to wear it, do you know what I mean? And because it's Ponty, it actually can go across so many sizes. You could also size down. It'll be tight, but it's how you want to wear it. That's how we design it. We show you the most trending way. You do you because you've got the body shape yeah. that only you know, really, and you've got yeah. to feel it. And also, you're kind of different sizes, top and bottom, you know, like, you know, I've got the thick waist thing going on, but everyone's got their own thing going on, which they have to play with. Uh, but that's what's so good about shooting. And yeah. that's what we love the most, yeah. body shooting, because it makes everything fit beautifully on you. Mm, yeah, exactly. Okay, I think we're done now. We're done now.